Hi. Oh my gosh, my camera battery is literally dying. How could I be so stupid? Oh. know what dance moves I was just trying to accomplish but I would have hit the jerk if it wasn't midnight and my mom wasn't asleep so it may look like we started this video not far wait what am I saying hello guys I put my camera battery on charge and we are here we're doing it so welcome to today's video I feel like I get myself in this predicament at the end of every single month hopefully May is a little bit better period Charlie said okay queen I'm gonna go sit over here and I'm currently filming this well it's midnight right now so it's technically Friday April 29th I am gonna pull it all better to get through the last little bit of my TBR that I feel inclined to read this month. Little backstory, super quickly. I feel like on my channel, I'm known for, in, per, in quotations, known for my very, very ever ambitious monthly TBRs. So if you're new here, if this is like your first video or if you just came across my channel, um, hi. Every month I do a monthly reading wrap up and then after that I do a monthly TBR. They're very ambitious, always like over 15 books. I just always find myself at like the last two weeks of the month being like, I've read three books, but it's the 29th, so I have technically today's Friday, and then we have Saturday to kind of get as many books as I can, but I thought, why not pull an all-nighter? You know, why not make myself miserable tomorrow? So here we are. Obviously, I'm tired, because I'm not even thinking straight right now. The reason that I'm starting it this late is because, oh God, I was editing a video, and I just got done with it not that long ago which is my tier ranking book talk books which you guys should go watch that because as of right now like as of when i'm literally speaking right now it is i think one of my favorite videos because just the way that i edited it it took me for freaking ever i just like it so go watch it if you haven't because i love that video so we are starting it now so here are my options for what I want to read. They're all thick. So I have four books to choose from. There's, I definitely am going to be reading Culty by Mariana Zapata. I read one Mariana Zapata book a month and this is my Mariana Zapata book pick of the month. Then we have another thick book, which I don't know quite sure if we're gonna get to because honestly, this is also a thick book. How many pages? It's like basically 500 pages. Pretty sure it's 499 pages. We're gonna say it's 500. And this is Twisted Hate by Anna Huang. And then we have Most of All You by Mia Sheridan, which is like 300 pages, a little bit over 300 pages. And this one is almost 400. But the difference is, is that this one is like a companion novel and this one is just like a standalone. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but I just figured you guys should know. I don't know. I am going to start with Culty by Mariana Zapata just to make sure that I read this. And plus I want to, like this was the book that I had already planned on reading next anyway. Let's get started. <laughs> Imagine, like I did that cool TikTok and just imagine. Okay, but first, if we're gonna make it through this all-nighter, if I'm gonna make it through this all-nighter, because fun fact, I literally go to bed at like nine. So this is gonna be hard for me. We need to pull out all the stops. Hi, and welcome to my kitchen. Pulling out all the stops. Okay. You're right, your eyes do not deceive you. This is a Red Bull because believe it or not, Red Bull does give you wings. Mm -hmm. Red Bull gives you wings. Red Bull is like the only energy drink that like can genuinely keep me up and at it. Also, it makes me highly anxious to even drink these because my mom is like, if you drink one of those, you're gonna start having heart palpitations and literally die and have a heart attack. It makes me genuinely scared for my life. Oh my God. 
You guys can't see, but a Red Bull commercial just came on. I don't drink them a lot because they are very bad for your heart. So this is a necessity if I want to. Also, just thought I should point out, I literally have a full face of makeup on right now because I've had it on all day. I physically cannot fall asleep, not even to take a nap if I have a full face of makeup on. So this is also something, a stipulation, stimulate, stipu, stipulate, whatever, to keep me up because I literally cannot fall asleep if I don't remove my makeup. What was it, last week? It was last week, I'm pretty sure. I literally drank one of these bad boys. Sounds like I drink them kind of frequently, but I don't. I literally hadn't had one since like my junior year. I used to be obsessed with monsters and Red Bulls my junior year. Not anymore though. Mm, but they're just so good. They taste like a sour punch roll, like a green apple sour punch roll condensed into a drink. So good. But anyway, I drank one of those last week because I was like cleaning my room and stuff like that. And then I decided, hey, I'm not tired. I'm going to pick up Long Way Down and try like read some of it. I stayed up until like six o'clock in the morning and read it the whole entire book with no breaks. It was an experience for sure. Hopefully this starts kicking in soon. Hopefully it does. But I'm gonna finish the rest of this in a timely manner and then check in with you guys. I'm probably gonna like pick up my book and start reading a little bit, so. Oh my god oh, i just almost knocked this over that would have been so bad i'm already like five pages into colty not that that's impressive or anything i did spend a good amount of time looking for a pencil and i did find it in my pencil case from high school and it made me <laughs> have a little bit of a ptsd moment let's see should we do some like predictions for what i feel like this book will be i'm feeling like this will be a four star shall it live to the hype i don't know right now it is 12 50 and i say we check in at like uh i probably should have started this at one we'll just say like this is like because it's basically one o'clock in the morning so we'll just say this is like our one o'clock in the morning check-in i'm starting culty by mario zapata and i am going to kind of sporadically share some thoughts that i'm having and then we're going to check in like at every hour does that sound good guys i'm just like formatting this video as i go okay so just roll with me here with you guys i'm having a little bit of a hard time staying awake i'm literally only 33 33 pages into this book right now i have also down this whole entire red bull and i feel like it's starting to kick in i feel like it's starting to kick in i literally just got off the phone with isaac talking his head off talking his head off oh my god i just want you guys to see how freaking cute charlie looks right now look at her oh she's the sweetest i want to cry literally literally oh my god she just curled up in her little ball it was so cute i want to rant about two things both of them concerning tiktok first of all i know that it's an outlet for anybody to say whatever they want but like personally i want i block every single person that makes a tiktok about their dog going to the other side of the line okay going to heaven it genuinely ruins my day i, I just need to stop it there just just know that if you make a tiktok like that and i come across it i'm blocking you immediately blocking you also i have a hot take it's not really a hot take it's just annoying on book talk i am definitely on book talk something that is so annoying to me is that i get all of my book recommendations from book talk really and a lot of them from booktube like both of them are equal and the same literally on book talk like if i already read a book and i notice that someone like made a tiktok about it like recommending it they literally spoil the the book <sighs> that was not known like for example with november 9th if you haven't read november 9th then skip ahead because it's literally a spoiler literally people are all over tiktok and i know you guys have seen it where they're like we keep his baby monitor on at night 
Like, come on, people are not stupid. You can put two and two together. Like, I don't know what other books people do that with, but they literally, like, spoil it. And I'm like, it's so annoying. You guys can literally make it about something that is on, like, the back of the book. That's it for my rant. I'm also having a really bad headache right, right here in my cranium, so. I'm gonna take a break and rip for a second. Hey guys, so it's two o'clock in the morning. We've reached the two hour mark. <laughs> guess how guess how far into this book I am? I'm 10% through the book. I'm just not in it. At this point, I'm like, for us to even be able to like move forward in this, should I pick up another book and then just like try to read this tomorrow during the day? What should I do? I think I'm gonna start Most of All You by Mia Sheridan. Oh, I'm so tired. I'm watching Parks and Recreation. That's all I have to say for now. slowly but sure surely mentally deteriorating i am 15 percent through most of all you i don't know what it is like i was reading this for a little bit and now i feel like i'm kind of oh my god i literally hate having the hiccups now i feel like i'm kind of getting into the groove of the of things but i was like reading and i was like i just don't feel like reading right now. Can't focus on the pages, but that's also because I forgot how my body reacts to caffeine of any sorts, like coffee, energy drinks. It is so bad, like my body, I don't even know. I want to finish this. I want to be at least like 50% through by four. Literally, maybe like I'm gonna pull an all nighter and at least read two books. I'm not even gonna get one book done. Oh my god, I'd probably get this done by like five. I don't know why I'm reading so slow. I feel like it's because I don't feel like reading, but I am. Also, I placed a bet with Isaac that I could stay up until seven. So that's like my motivator. I'm gonna keep on reading this. Why am I having the hardest time with this book right now? Literally, it's cringing me out. Like, the main dude, like, literally, I am on page 68. He's literally, like, begging her to talk to him. He's like, no, please, I need you. And I'm like, you just met her four days ago. I don't know if I can get through this book. Why is this so hard for me? Why am I hitting a wall with all these books that I'm reading? This is not a good sign. Not a good sign at all for me. online shopping for like an hour i have 17 items in my checkout just at princess polly i was looking at other websites too and it is 800 dollars. i wasn't gonna buy that anyway now i'm gonna go look at books because i fun fact so over there you can't see it but i have been collecting my packages amazon packages packages in general of books that i've been ordering and that people have sent me some of you guys have sent me some packages and that is literally so sweet. I love you guys so much. You guys are literally the best. I have been ordering like some of the books that I have like saved on TikTok to get. And so I've been ordering those. And actually the other day I ordered somebody's book off TikTok. They like just wrote their own book and it seemed super cute. And I lucked out because I can't tell you how many times I've freaking been going through TikTok. And they're like saying a scenario and the people are like book what's a book and they're like oh it's the book i'm writing like i don't know when it's ever gonna be out and if it ever will be and then i'm like girl i came across her tiktok and she's like oh yeah it's coming out like in next week and i was like so i ordered it i'm gonna link it down below it seems awesome and i don't know when it's supposed to be here i have been trying to look for better than the movies by lynn painter because i don't want the hardcover of it i want the uh, paperback because the paperback is yellow. Here's the paperback and see how the paperback is yellow. I don't like that cover. I like this cover. It's the same, but it's just like the colors are flipped. Yeah. <laughs> I 
40. I just, I don't know why I felt like that's the only time that I, that I showed what time it is. I don't know, I'm just tired. I'm literally on page 205. I don't even know how far that is in the book, but I just want to be done with it already. I found the quote though, that like everyone talks about in this book. And she's like, I'm sorry for leaving without telling you. I'm just good at running, I guess. And he's like, I don't mind chasing you, Ellie. Just let me catch you once in a while. That's like literally the cutest thing that's happened in this whole entire book. <sighs> My gosh, I have the biggest headache right now. It is 6.24. I just finished Most of All You by Mia Sheridan, but I put it over with my other books that I have read this month already. I read that in two stars. Really did not enjoy this book. I love Archer's Voice. Archer's Voice is like one of my five star books. Love Archer Hale. A lot of people said that they liked this book. And I mean, what they people were like, it's not as good as Archer's Voice, but still good. No. I think I'm only gonna do this video for like 30 more minutes. And then we successfully pulled an all night. For the last however much, I'm gonna try to read a little bit more of Colty. I've been watching Parks and Rec for so long. Oh my god, I have such a bad headache. I feel bad for anyone that has to come in contact with me today. 7.02 a.m. And I pulled an all-nighter. It was a little rocky, I'll be honest. A few times I was like, I don't know if I'll be able to do this. But I am 20% through Colty right now. Not my fave, Mariana Zapata. Honestly, I mean, I'm not like judging the book right now, but like as of right now, this would definitely rank the lowest. Just so repetitive. Like I feel like every page that I'm reading is the exact same as the last one. I am probably gonna go lay down for like an hour because my body just can't sleep through. The sun is rising. There wasn't a pretty sunrise today because it's super gloomy outside, but I'm going to end the vlog here. I literally read one book. <laughs> literally read I mean I don't know what I was expecting especially since these books that I was wanting to read are thicker like obviously I wasn't gonna read more than one book I mean we read one book and we're 20% through this book you know I, I will take it but that's it for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed I thought that this would be a fun little video to do I thought it would be interesting because I rarely rarely ever pull all-nighters like ever I used to pull them a lot when I was in high school and uh yeah no I made a promise to myself that I would never do that again don't forget comment like subscribe notification bell all of that stuff that you guys know all of that YouTube stuff help me with the algorithm I still don't know how all that works like honestly I feel fake whenever I say that because I'm like I know it helps with the algorithm them, I just don't ask me how. I hope you guys enjoyed and that is it. I will see you guys when I see you. Peace. I'm so sore.